The Congress President Sonia Gandhi has declared that her party would pay the fare of uh, migrants travelling back home in the special trains, calling them the backbone of our economy and the ambassadors of our nation's growth. Congress, as it claims, will not pay for the tickets, but how? This clarification is still awaited. For more on this, uh, let's go across to my colleague uh, Sunil Prabhu. Sunil, how exactly is Congress going to pay for this? Well, uh, the, there is a demand from the state governments and through the uh, state Pradesh Congress committees, uh, they will be raising funds and uh, pay for these migrant labors, whatever the cost is. Uh, the railways, of course, uh, through the railway minister, has tried to attribute and say that uh, we are bearing, bearing the cost of 85% of that uh, air fare, uh, the train fare. Uh, but as we are well aware, that 85% includes the railway uh, doctors, uh, the cost of the train ticket going up and down. Uh, there are a whole lot of other issues. So at a crisis like this, which is, you know, as uh, the Congress president pointed out, uh, equivalent to partition of India uh, in 1947, uh, these are very, very, it's, this is a pandemic and uh, this is something once in a century that it happens uh, where you need to show uh, some heart, some empathy uh, with those migrant workers who are keen uh, to go back uh, to their native places. Uh, you have seen late last night the Home Ministry trying to explain after state governments expressed their anguish about the way the notification had to take place. Uh, the Home Secretary had to write one more letter to the Chief Secretary. Uh, this will now be chronicled in a book as with the you know, 10th or 12th letter uh, in the last 30 days. It's in that context that uh, the state governments have made it clear uh, that those who want to go must be permitted to, but they've now explained, uh, given a new categorization, uh, which will be very difficult, uh, but nevertheless, a huge controversy, and uh, the, the state governments uh, from uh, every state uh, ready to uh, bear the cost uh, for those migrant labor who want to return to pay their fare through the railways.